What's good, everyone? It's your homie Hermit. We're back with another reaction. This is one I'm so incredibly, extremely excited for. Rhyme of the Ancient Mariner. This was the uh, the one Iron Maiden song. When we were first starting to check them out, I was like, oh man, I really don't want to check this one out because it's so long. And like nine times out of ten, eight times out of ten, I do not like long songs. But with this one that totally changed my attitude on it and it made me start paying attention to songs that i would have looked at the time and been like no that's too long i'm not checking out and it's made me start appreciating so many new songs that i never even gave light of day uh to before um it's making me want to try new genres of music just because I wouldn't try that genre of rock and roll because the songs were too long, you know? So a lot, a lot comes back to Rhyme of the Ancient Mariner. I absolutely love this song. So I'd easily put it in my, uh, it, it, yeah, it'd probably fall in top five. Maybe, maybe just out of top five, like sixth or seventh, but easily top ten. Um, let's hop into it. I can't wait for this song. The flourishes are just what drives me crazy on this song. That little just on the fucking guitar, just that, just that quickness. It's just satisfying, and a little a little extra flavor in there to keep things spicy. You know what I mean? It it keeps it it keeps it good. It keeps it flavorful. Day after day, we're stuck up in the 
Easy. Dude, I, I just, I'm hearing this, and I'm imagining a packed arena with a bunch of fucking dudes having a great time, <laughs> smoky as hell. I see them fucking, like, 50 rows, I'm 50 rows back in my mind, and I just, like, it's smoky, I'm hot as hell, sweating my ass off, having a great time. It stinks like weed and ass in this building, and I'm just I'm loving it. I wouldn't ra I'd rather be nowhere else in the world. That's that's what I see in my mind when I when I'm hearing this part right now. That's awesome, man. seizure medication all right let's get back into this
this also is a great like middle performance song just so the guys can you know like everyone can catch their breath they can all you know breathe while this part's going everything is relaxed and stuff everyone can you know bounce back a little bit get catch that second wind to destroy the rest of the show you know it's I would imagine it this is probably one that they use in their longer shows to do something like that they play would typically play around the middle of their show
fucking beautiful. The very end of that was fucking beautiful. The guitar solos were immaculate. They were pristine. I couldn't believe how clean those guitar solos were live on this one. Because, dude, they, it, this one, I, I, I like, I'm just kind of taken back. I don't really know what to say. I'm just so impressed by it. Um, I loved this song studio version. I th th so far, like, I guess I think it might be a little bit of a cop out to say, but this is gonna be my favorite Iron Maiden album because it's got all the songs that I love, and they're in amazing live performance quality. I absolutely love this album. And I am so glad you guys did not let me skip this. Uh, because I didn't have any intention in doing a live album. So I really appreciate you guys pushing for Live After Death being done. Because it turned out to be my favorite uh, thing to listen to so far. Every song has been incredible. Either just as good or better than, in my opinion, as uh, to their studio counterpart. This record is incredible. I would have definitely stood in the line to get this one. I would have, oh, uh, dude. <laughs> to go back in time and uh, see this show, this show in particular, in person, I think a lot of us would give more than our left arm for that, you know, to keep it clean. <laughs> uh, yeah, dude, this, this was incredible. Um, I'm, I can't believe I ha am so just fascinated and just attracted to and blown away by a band that I had always knew about. I always knew about Iron Maiden. I always liked their merchandise. I had I had heard a couple songs on the radio that I liked. Never dove into them. Out of laziness, I guess it would be. But, man. Definitely, definitely glad i'm checking out iron maiden because there's been like five ten artists or bands that i'm like i can't imagine not listening to them now and a year ago i wasn't listening to them you know a year ago most of the artists that are on that list uh, iron maiden excluded uh i hadn't even heard of so it's crazy to think because uh, now I listen to Iron Maiden every day, dude. I listen to them every day. I listen to one song every day. Uh, it's crazy to think <laughs> I've never, I went 27 years without listening to them. They could have been my favorite band for so long. I think it's safe to say that they're my favorite band now. Like, I I absolutely love Nirvana, but that was that was a different stage of life. I need something more mature and refined, but still rebellious and energetic. You know, I fucking love Iron Maiden. Uh, yeah, big shout out to you guys for for getting me into Iron Maiden. I appreciate every one of you guys for checking out the videos, your kind words every day. Um, I just, I fucking love these guys, man. I uh, can't wait to check out more. This journey is not stopping anytime soon. I plan on listening to every record, even if, even if it's like, I don't like it, I'll still give it a shot, you know? Um, yeah, dude. I've, I'm such a fan of this, man. I, I can't wait to hear uh, Hallowed Be Thy Name. That was the one. That was the one, man. That was the moment when 
when he said uh the sands of time for me are running low and then he comes back in and sings running low again that was the moment i became a fan so i cannot wait to hear that song again on this album i've so yeah big shout out to everybody who's been watching the videos big shout out to all the patreon supporters everybody checking out the tiktok content and the live streams um big shout out to all the iron maiden fans who uh who put me on to some great great music and uh let's keep going man uh we'll catch you at the next one i hope you all have an amazing rest of your day peace